brentuximab velutine or SGN35 built on uh, the um, CD30 that we found about 30 years ago in our uh, in my um, cell line L428 and uh, the naive antibody anti CD30 is rather uh, ineffective so we couldn't do very much with this antibody but then uh, a genetics uh, chemist was as clever and intelligent to put in a uh, bomb on that, and this is a tubulin inhibitor, uh, auristatin, and with a certain linker, uh, it's released in the cell, uh, the uh, auristatin and the tubulin uh, inhibitor acts on the um, um, mitosis and inhibits mitosis and that leaves the cell then um, um, being killed and possibly also influences the microenvironment. Therefore, we have about 35% complete remissions in refractory and far advanced um, relapsing patients. And this is a great new uh, advance and it is now used in the United States with AVD plus brentuximab and in Germany we uh, built a new uh, regime, um, a detoxified um, uh, BCOP regimen where we leave out the procarbacine and uh, the long-term uh, prednisone at um, um, darcarbacine, brentuximab and dexamethasone.